Good afternoon, good people, truth seekers, patriots around the world, United States of America, and here along the southern international border in Sierra Vista, Arizona. I am Michael DiCarlo. This is DiCarlosDanger.com, my blog. It is 2.44 in the afternoon, Mountain Standard Time, on the 14th of November, 2018. And I just had some uh, thoughts come to me, and this is just what ifs, this isn't, this is true. But uh, I, I would challenge you guys to actually listen to the Secretary of Defense's uh, press conference he did in an airplane. Uh, and those of you with talent reading messages or experienced reading messages, if you hear if you hear what he's saying, I don't fear patriots, my brother patriots. But if you hear what I'm, if you hear what he's saying. Especially when they said got to the point where the yeah, there's nothing new under the sun. Well, that rung true. I went and I uh, was doing a little bit of background research on the occurrences around this area, and there was a drug bust for 350 pound 315 315315, uh, so 31 and a half degrees <laughs> pounds of uh, cannabis marijuana coming through the Douglas Port of Entry. And Agua Prieta, Mexico, it was, and it was a, uh, it was masked with the, the smell of, uh, soap or detergent. Detergents are chemicals. Some of that stuff's gonna bleed into the plant, and that's pretty funny. But either way, the lady was busted. She had a kid in the car, she, but she was stopped and sent to secondary because she was shaking and she averted her eyes. So if you appear, if you appear nervous when you go to the border patrol checkpoints here in Arizona, and those of you that live down by the border, and you know, in Mexico, New Mexico, in Texas, California, you know what I mean. Uh, so if you're if you're brown and you avert your eyes and sh are shaking when they're talking to you. Uh, and you smell like Tide. Don't don't say that you just had a Tide pod because that ain't gonna work. Uh, continuing on, there's nothing new under the sun. Just read about the leadership. Jim Jordan didn't win the leadership in the House of Representatives, so we have two whack two uh, the House of Representatives. And this is this is for you those of you who uh, want to get rid get rid of the. Electoral College, this is where it comes into play. We have both the majority and minority leader being from the state of California. What's the brokest state in the whole country? California. Uh, they can't. They haven't been able to balance a budget book since Reagan was governor. Before that, but now they're the the house is where all taxis are levied from and started from. So, you got the holder of the purse being from different parties, but yet from the same state. Both of them are for welfare. One corporate, and the other one social. So, no matter how things change, they still remain the same. They're actually going to get anticipate more tax proposals coming from uh, the House of Representatives. Just glad that uh, there will be some argument and some check and balance in the Senate prior to going as a rubber stamp up to the president for signature. Other than the last part is uh, we're going to come across an article that uh, the same article that and this is the coincidence. My blog was recently visited by Washington D.C. and from. Uh, was it Wyoming? Yeah. For the first time in a long time. But uh, a Cheney has been elected to communications. The last time a Cheney was in charge of communications in, the, in an executive capacity. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> oh, wait, and boom. Close to home. 
and then a plane disappeared into hard mountainous rock area. Wow. Yeah, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it really, nothing in the world is as we see it. I did watch a presentation, and I, you know what? Uh, from what I saw from different videos from different people, John B. Wells put on a great uh, symposium down there in Dallas. I kind of wish I would have went. But uh, when I was on my way to the Purple purple Party purple party thing uh, up in Phoenix, my right front drive blew out and took out my brake line and everything on my truck. So it's been up in Casa Grande. Since then, I shop and I have a rental car. You went from an F-350 Dually to a Ford Fiesta. Talk about trying to fit in the tuna can. But anyway, uh, Cheney's in charge of the of the Republican Party's message, communications message. So, fear mo anticipate more fear-mongering, fear-mongering, and stuff like that. Uh, it isn't that I don't have a sense of humanity. I do. But we can't even take care of our own people. What business we got to be around the world taking care of everybody else? Uh, not that we can't lend a hand, but... Sometimes when, uh, one thing you got to remember is everywhere the army goes, it never leaves. <laughs> everywhere the government goes, it never leaves. It never leaves, folks. As Ronald Reagan said, I'll paraphrase here, there's nothing quite like eternal life on earth than a bureau in the federal government or something like that. Well, peace to all friends. Caution to all enemies. No quarter for, no quarter for tyrants. Y'all be well. Happy health to you. We'll talk to you later.